Today, I'll show you this new improved optimization pack. To put your curiosity at ease, let's get right into it. Simply open the first link down in the description, it's a short link for the pack. Now it should put you in this Google Drive link. After downloading the pack, extract the file in your desktop. The pack contains 6 folders. Let's make a restore point first, this will be our backup if you didn't like the new optimization. Create a restore point where your system files is stored. Press create. Then type anything that's easy to remember. For this video, I'll put optimization. Second folder will be regedit files. Regedit is a tool made by Windows that allows users to view the Windows registry and make changes, so it is important to make a restore point first. Simply open them by double-clicking then press yes then OK. Don't worry these changes won't give any viruses or malware in your computer. Third folder will be game user settings file. I recommended three game user settings inside this folder to install. I added a shortcut for the game user settings file location and a folder for backup. To backup your game user settings, simply open the shortcut then open the optimization folder. Copy your game user settings then paste it in the backup folder. Now pick what you want in these three game user folders, if you already decided, open that folder and you'll see the settings, click on it, hold, then drag it in the folder. Now for the fourth folder, inside of this folder are two applications that help us reduce input delay. I added an instruction inside of each application, if you still don't know what to do, follow my example. Leave the filter key setter open, just hit apply then leave it in the background. I inserted some commands in the text file, some others got 0.499 or 0.496, instead of 0.500, to execute the commands, open command prompt in administrator. Then insert the commands one by one. Restart your PC then open timer resolution then press maximum. Just like filter key setter, leave it running in the background. Now for the fifth folder, this is for RAM optimization. To install, open the installer, press OK, next, next again then choose where you want to store the files, personally I'll store it in my download disk. Then press next, next again, then next again. You can enable create a desktop icon if you want to. MZ RAM improve the performance of your computer by auto-recovering RAM, and also improve PC performance, not just for Fortnite game. Go ahead and open the application. After that, head over to System Speed Up, press Recommended Values, then Apply Values, same goes with options. You can now exit the program, don't worry it's running in the background. Now for the last folder, this contains two application. I also leave an instruction in every single one of them. Let's go with throttle stop first, simply open the application. There should be four options. Performance, game, internet, and battery. For this video, we will going to choose game and enable high performance, speed shift, BD pro code, speed step, and C1E. Make sure it's turned on, you can check it by looking at throttle hidden icon. If it's green, that means it's on. If it's red, that means it's off. Now, save it and leave it running at the background as usual. Now for the park control application, simply install the program just like what we did in MZ RAM. Now, it should be automatically open after installation. Make sure everything is turned off or everything is at 100%. Press apply then leave it running at the background. You can choose your preferred power plan profile, I'll choose mine to be high performance, and press make active also. You can see what power plan is currently active, in current system power status. That's all for today's video, I'll see you in the next one.